Hello Twin Flames and welcome to your daily check-in for Tuesday. My name's Liz and this is Guided by Angels and we're going to bring in the Divine Structure Deck for the question today and if you would like a personal reading with me I am available right now. You can email me at guidedbyangelsxo at gmail.com. So thank you angels, what's the question we need to be focusing on today? What's the question we need to be focusing on today. I've got one card sticking out of the deck. So, and this card's moving at the back of the deck as well. So the first card is divine guidance for reunion. Now, this is really powerful because this is a great sign that reunion is ahead. So we're giving you guidance today about how you can be ready for reunion. And what is reunion? It's when you come back together after a period of time apart. It's when you reconnect. It's the journey to your union. It's the stepping stones to being in union. So union is when you are in a permanent relationship and that's a permanent relationship, which means you've already healed and worked through all the things keeping you permanently apart. You've healed all those things so you can start a new way of being together and make it permanent. And obviously there's no nothing permanent in this life because this life is, you know, a, a fleeting moment. But for the remainder of your lifetime, you can be together in a relationship in a permanent way. That's what union is. And to make that happen, you reunite to talk about that future, to share time and be intimate and show each other the power of the love. So the real energy I've got coming through here is don't let the mind cause problems that don't need to be there. Our mind can be our greatest teacher, that's true, because we learn from the things we go through in our mind, but our mind can be our best friend or our worst enemy. In other words, the thoughts we think create our reality. So trust in union. And trust that your reunion, you're coming back together as a head. I know you can feel this. You'll probably feel like a message is on the way, that your masculine is thinking about you. And the divine guidance is that you know your reunion is coming because you'll feel it. You'll feel it in your heart. You'll feel it in your soul. You'll feel it in the tips of your fingers, the top of your head and the tips of your toes. You'll feel it all through your body. You'll see signs and synchronicities that show you the way. You'll be reminded of your twin everywhere you go and you'll feel this sense of peace, but also this sense of urgency that something is happening and something is coming. And look at this. Do they know we are twin flames? So you may be wondering if they know that. And the thing is, the masculines understand that you are twin flames, but they understand it in a different way. Feminines, you'll understand the label because you'll be around other twin flames. You'll be watching twin flame readings. You'll be learning about the twin flame journey. The masculines understand through the way they feel. And obviously, we both feel that way. Both feminine and masculines feel that way. But the masculines go with the feelings over the labels. They feel that you belong. They feel that you have a soul connection. So they may resonate more with the word soulmate than twin flame. That doesn't mean there's anything wrong. It means everything's right because they know that you have a soul bond and a soul connection. So they know inside that you have a bond unlike anything else and that you are mirrors. So the divine guidance for your reunion is to understand that when you come back together, they will understand on some deep level that you are twin flames. So I'm going to bring in two decks of cards for this today. We're going to bring in the Angel Wisdom Tarot, Great Debt by Rally Valentine, and the Soul's Journey Lesson cards. So first of all, daily or divine guidance for reunion. They're reminding you that, you know, you get daily guidance here on the channel. You know, you get daily guidance on the channel. So that helps too. That helps you to move into your reunion. So we need guidance for reunion, please, angels. Guidance for reunion. Guidance for reunion. Jumps out of the deck. There we go. And do they know that you are twin flames? Do they know that you are twin flames? Do they know that you are twin flames? Wow. 
cards that I'm feeling is the front and the back card. And I'm actually being guided to use a twin flame message tarot. So divine guidance for reunion. Jump straight out of the deck. And that card. And do they know that you are twin flames? Again, jump straight out. So I've got all the energies now. We've got the cards for the twin flames and cards for the reunion. So let's see what you need to know. Divine guidance for reunion, which I feel is coming soon. Enjoy your life. This is really powerful. The more you enjoy your life, the quicker things will happen. The more you enjoy your life, the more you are in the energy of surrender and the more likely it is to take place quicker. So the message is enjoy your life and the way will be created. Love life. Work on self-love. Love the things you do. Focus on the joy in your life and know that you are a strong and powerful leader. Write about your thoughts, write about your feelings, write gratitude, do things that make you feel good and follow your heart to choose your next steps. And I really feel this is connected with the masculine. So I feel this is the feminine energy and this is the masculine energy. So feminines, divine guidance for reunion is enjoy your life remember who you are you are strong and powerful and you are a leader and write down things that you're thinking about you know you may want to share those things with the world at some point maybe you want to write a blog or write a book or share your thoughts on social media but the masculines will follow their hearts to choose their next steps that means they will follow their heart over their heads and reach out to you and look at this, celebrations ahead, expect reunion. And they jumped out of the deck. So the divine guidance for reunion is to expect reunion. There's going to be a celebration ahead. And this could happen very quickly, definitely within the next three months. Some of you are going to receive communication within three hours. Some of you are going to receive communication within three days. Some of you, it's going to take a bit longer. It could take three weeks or three months or between now and the energy of August time, but your celebration, your reunion is ahead. So the angels are reminding you of your power, that you are brilliant, talented, independent, but sometimes controlling. So you have to let that go, the control, wanting it now, wondering when, step out of the way and let the universe sort it out, and enjoy your independence, enjoy your freedom, enjoy the things you love to do, your talents, Feel good about things and know that there's nothing you can't do. Believe in yourself. So the guidance for reunion is to believe in yourself, to never underestimate your twin because they will follow their heart and their truth and never underestimate your ability to make your dreams come true. You may need to balance things. You may need a balanced connection but everything is working out. And it's also about balancing career and personal life, which means if you focused everything on your twin right now, start focusing energy back into your career or the things you love to do, and that will create the way. And we've got doubt, release the doubt, release the need to know all the answers, the when, the how, the if, give that to God. So to bring this reunion in, you have to release the doubt in your mind and understand it's all part of the purpose. I know what I am here to do. Your masculine knows in their heart and soul what they are here to do. And they know that that involves you and that, you know, it's about being with you. So it's part of their purpose to connect with you and come back into your life. And you know what to do. You know that gratitude, feeling at ease, enjoying life, being patient and calm is part of the process. So do they know that you are twin flames? King of Wands, you have a loyal heart. They may not get the label divine feminine, but they have a loyal heart. And they are loyal to you and they want you to know that. The end of challenging times. So it's going to feel so much better than it used to be. Things are looking up, a welcome relief. So it feels good to spend time together. It feels good to come back together. You're both finding your way to a peaceful place. The end of any depression or ascension or illness or physical things, travel or relocation. And I love that we've got the swan that's guiding the boat because the swan is the symbol of the divine feminine and the divine feminine is leading the way so this is really a message that says 
The twin flame journey is coming to the end of a challenging time. Things are looking up in your twin flame journey. Of course, they understand that you are twin flames, but not the way you think. They may recognize the label. They may recognize it later down the line but they recognize that you are their future and that you are the peaceful place that they are being guided to. So there's going to be travel and relocation. And also there's going to be success because the Knight of Wands is action. Passionate, confident, charismatic, restless. The masculines are restless right now because they want to come towards you. So feminines be confident, feel the love, and understand that there's going to be events requiring immediate action. So this is moving forward very quickly. And when you trust your instinct, you know they are twin flames. You know you are. You know they feel that way. And I feel this is also, thank you angels, that you recognize other twin flames. You know they are twin flames. So you will look at other couples and know they are twin flames because that's your instinct and you're in a guidance system. So stay focused because this is a passionate relationship. So your masculine is saying, I may not realize it's twin flames as in that's the label, but I certainly realize that this is a passionate relationship and something I want to focus on. And I feel restless when I'm without you and my instincts point to you and tell me that I need to take immediate action to you. And also that you bring change into my heart. I understand that nothing can grow or evolve without movement. So this is about wanting to move things around, move things forward, make changes. And also to release the blame. I accept responsibility for my well-being. So understand that your twin flame doesn't have the power to make you happy. And you might think, what? Isn't that what it's all about? The only person who can make you happy is you. The only person who can make you happy is you. When you make yourself happy, your twin is an extension of that happiness. It's not their responsibility to validate you or make you happy. It's yours. And when you release that feeling or that need for them to be the ultimate answer to your happiness, you find it with it. And all the doors open and they become the extension of your true power and light. So you accept responsibility and forgive yourself and you accept responsibility and forgive them and you stop blaming others and you start feeling at peace and that leads to success. I know that there is no greater goal than to love. So your masculine recognizing that you are the goal, that the success is coming because there's no greater goal than your love and they intend to come towards you and show you that through reunion. So divine guidance for reunion is there will be a success. There's no greater goal than this love. So release all the blame and accept responsibility for your own well-being and change your thoughts and feelings towards love and understand that everything is changing right now. This love is passionate and powerful and strong and easier times are ahead, the end of a challenge. They have a loyal heart and so do you. And they do know that you are twin flames, even if they don't recognize the label. They recognize that you have a purpose together. They realize that you need to release the doubt and that you are the one. And that's why they're coming forward to tell you this. They want to follow their heart to choose their next step. So feminines, enjoy life. Write about your thoughts and feelings. And remember how strong you are because this reunion is ahead. I hope this helps. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.